Hello there. How are we doing, everyone? Hello there. Oh my god. What is that? It is me! It is the bee! How is it going, everyone? I'm here. On, tr on YouTube! Who is this boy on YouTube? This chaotic mess? Who is he? What is going on here? It's almost like I have, by the way, I have nothing set up for bots or anything. So shout outs are going to be uh, a lot more difficult to do. Um, I'm going to figure that out. Uh, I'm doing all the figuring out for that, but I wanted to stream on YouTube today And I wanted to try working this out and be a little tester stream for us. I made a little cute little thumbnail today um, And I thought it would be good to use so let's We got this we do got this. Thank you Hi <laughs> And chatting is going to be non-existent on chat uh, side of it. So we are just, we're just going to do this. How about that? Because <laughs> the chat bottles are not going to show up at the moment. Congratulations on my YouTube first stream. Thank you so much, David. I appreciate it. I have mm, many things to chat with y'all about. We are here. Um, I do not have the bot set up for our discord as well, so, uh, I'm going to have to ping everyone. But I can do that as well. Let me...
if you're wondering um, what this uh, what this stream's going to entail today, um, yo, excuse me, is that is that a Kato I see? Hello, welcome on in, Kato. How are we doing today? <laughs> I hear from the grapevine and watching y'all's vods back. I hear that y'all had a had an interesting time getting four lilies. Yo, get out! Thank you so much for the sub. <laughs> I saw y'all got uh, four lilies from it, from our little twist. Um, the commentators kept telling us and saying that we didn't know about any of the twists and that we had spies all in y'all's chat we had nothing we were just vibing literally at one point we just had uh <laughs> we literally had everything all set up and we were like whoa. we were like all prepared to do stuff and be all like competitive competitive no we were sitting there reading from a would you rather book and just being like, would you rather be covered with bees or uh, <laughs> or spiders? We we were not. I promise you, we were not. <laughs> we were not trying. But welcome on into the campsite for our very first stream on YouTube. I figured if we're gonna be doing a bunch of these games and everyone seems to be uh, migrating to YouTube, I uh, I thought I'd get a little dinkum action in here. And uh, we'll hang out. But thank you, Kato. I appreciate you so very much. Hi, how are you? Hi, how are you? Everyone telling y'all about, uh, telling us about y'all with spies. We had nothing. We had nothing. Y'all were, y'all were getting fed false information. We had nobody. Not a single person was spying for us. We were like, y'all have spies on us. Y'all are like. I was like, y'all, y'all clearly, y'all clearly got spies on us because we had nothing. <laughs> we were trying. We were honestly trying to just like vibe out. It did not help that y'all got four lilies from the twist, which we read the board and it said two. And we were like, okay, cool. Y'all got four. I went, oh, okay, I see you. No, we, and then, and that's the point. We were like, y'all are going to spy on us. We're just like, whatever, like, just say whatever. Like, I'm like, yeah, I got lilies in the back over here. You know, whatever. We didn't care. We did not care. We had zero care in the world. Uh, Stop it. Get some help. Yeah, no. <laughs> so today we're going to be going over some campsite ideas for everyone that are involved with the Dinkum scene and has been just praying and hoping for Dinkum content and been thinking, well, Dinkum, all of my Animal Crossing YouTubers have migrated to Dinkum. Uh, except for everyone's now going back to Animal Crossing because they're modding their switches. <laughs> so... Have at it. <laughs> Y'all have a good time. I am going to enjoy continuing being all into Dinkum and everything. So <laughs> let's get uh, let's get Dinkum open. Why not? Let's uh, let's show off what we've got going on in the Dinkum verse. Our uh, our Dinkum uh, our Dinkum Island is if you are unfamiliar with our Dinkum Island, our Dinkum Island is called IBS. <laughs> Because I am Captain IBS, and I make all the shit happen, so, uh, you know. Yeah, for sure. So, uh, let's, uh... <laughs> I was all into Dinkum until you lost your save file. I know, I saw that tweet. I was like, oh, no! Oh, I'm so sorry for all of that. Now you're like, ugh. Well, I hope I can potentially inspire you. Um, I saw a lot of your builds, and I really liked how rustic and very naturey they are. As you can see by these by these luscious locks, I like I used to live in the forest when I growing up. I I I, I there was no really buddy around me. My friends were trees um, and plants, 
and all the little spiders and salamanders I could catch. Uh, so <laughs> to say that uh, it was honestly uh, nature is my best friend, basically, which is why we're kind of the uh, all about the campsite here. But we're going to pull up our little stream here. Let's see. All right. Let's go to IBS, everybody. Um, hello. It is me on YouTube. Who is this boy on the YouTubes? Welcome on in, Aaron. Hi, how are you? How are we doing? All right. So today it is raining in game. Here is our lovely house. Very, uh, very cozy e vibes. We've got the uh, we've got the snow white. You love that you're here. I needed some code of quality time now. Yeah. Give me a hell yeah. What? <laughs> All right. It is raining, but um, we still have our naturey little little abode. We've got to get our abode on. Exactly. Don't forget to hit that like button. Thank you, Becca. I appreciate you. So here's our little lovely little area. We're actually going to probably potentially bring this out over here. Potentially gouge this over here. Move this down a little bit. Make it all flatter. Flate. And uh, make a little stairwell up there. Make it look nice and good. Make it look good. Make it look good. I'm all about the rustic, so uh, we've got we've got various rustic areas in our area. Um, that is not a giant chicken egg, actually. That is a um, it is kind of like a giant ki uh, chicken. It's a, a cassowary. Um, <laughs> our cassowaries. Uh, we stole a cassowary egg, and I thought it fit better over here. Let us, let's do that. Will it hatch? It will not hatch, no. Um, you can take these eggs and sell them. Uh, the idea is you steal the eggs and you sell them. But I have the idea that it would just would look really funny just sitting there <laughs> as a cassowary. I, I would like to capture a cassowary. I think I can make it if my, um, my trapping skills are good enough. We can trap them like pretty substantially in a just a um, a cage and we can cage them and put them there. We could do that. Our little uh, our little garden area. We're working on it. We're working on it. We are honestly. Let's get to it. First things first. Yes, absolutely. Check out Aaron. Please do so. We love you here. You are a good friend of ours. Thank you, Becca. I have none of my bots are uh, working on here. So it is the it is the Becca and Dakota show today. Um as we uh as we attempt to um maneuver as I attempt to maneuver this entirely new platform. Entire it's it's going to be a challenge. But you know what? I'm excited. I like making little. Uh, I like making little things, and uh, I actually wanted to do YouTube way before I wanted to do Twitch. So uh, yeah. This was this was my in my initial idea of doing content was doing it on here, so. I'm gonna do a latency check. Um, I'm gonna I'm gonna say uh, say your favorite color in chat. I want to see how quick uh, chat responds. Okay, that's good. 
That's that's uh sweet. Awesome, cool. Thank you guys. I appreciate you both. Yeah, I appreciate all three of you. Oh my god, y'all are paying so much more goddamn attention than than our uh, than our lurking Twitch chat. Oh my god, what are you guys doing? Usually uh my uh my janky self is uh having to entertain myself with buttons. I uh <laughs> I have literally I literally, my entire stream deck is just full of buttons for me to press because, m not gonna lie, uh, I like talking to myself, so I figured streaming is great for me, but no joke, um, no joke, I literally, uh, it's my, I have four pages of just sound effects, so, <laughs> it's a good vibe, <laughs> we're a good vibe with that. <laughs> and I need to add more too Right Becca I need to add a way more right I have uh, A gratuitous amount of them that I need to add Look at uh Don't Don't uh Don't pay any attention to the uh The field of uh The field of string lights over there which They, they, they may or not mean anything They may not mean anything over there Just We're gonna leave them alone <laughs> Oh, and since it's raining, I forgot that it's raining. The importance of that is, is I can actually show you the specialty shop. So we're going to go to the specialty shop today. Um, It's raining in real life too. I know it's raining over here too. It's super rainy, super rainy. I can't even believe how rainy it is. It's like overwhelmingly rainy. Oh, what? No way! Oh my god! Smoke weed every day. Smoke weed every day. Okay. It's a dang lava lamp. Hello? Hello? I didn't even know that was an item in the game. Are you kidding me? A lava lamp? Bruh. I have so many lava lamps around my apartment. Are you joking me? Oh my gosh. Yes, please. Yes, please. I want a hundred of those. I am going to buy a hundred of them. I'm going to waste all of my dink on lava lamps. Excuse me. I'm going to buy some lava lamps. Excuse me. Don't even have to mod them in. We don't even have to mod them in. They're already in the game. God damn. Just gonna buy a, a legion of lava lamps, don't mind me. Oh my god. Oh, also, uh, Becca's the only one who's ever seen this. Um, let me not get killed by a Krako. Hold on. Nonsense in that. Nonsense in that bin. And that's an actual bin. Not like a UK bin, um, but an actual bin. Well, I mean, if the stuff in there was garbage, I guess it would be also uh, like a UK bin, but... All right, we're gonna live on our... I'm gonna go grab something to show y'all. All right. Now, this... Now... I am I am I am a hippie through and through this right here. Let me show you Hold on There's an there's a reason why there's this is important importante to me uh, Here there we go look at this this is this is very dusty I know but the reason why this is so dusty this right here is a lava lamp from 1970. This is a lava lamp from the 70s. So lava lamps were originally you uh, did not use glitter or a lot of plastic like glass because a lot of uh, lava lamps use glass and um, plastic. So yeah, there's hippie vibes in my house. Honestly, yes it is. Behind me there's a tapestry on my patio. It's covering my patio. Um, we, we taped a tapestry up there. The tape job is 
horrid right now, but uh, we have a tapestry hanging up. But this is made of, this uses fat and other chemicals, but this is fat. So they used to use animal fat. When you burn it, the fat would congeal and that's what it's done right now, it's congealed. Um, but when you heat it up, it like, it, that's why it gets all goopy and like, it gets really stringy when you first heat it up. Um, it's actually, this is pretty, this isn't that solid. We, we heat it pretty regularly, but if this gets like a dark, like a dark brown, that means it's so solidified that it actually can't heat up anymore. And it's one of the reasons why a lot of collectors and vintage, uh, of vintage lava lamps, um, that you want to make sure that you, uh, you heat them up regularly. Yeah, multiple lava lamps, tapestries, uh, plants, crystals. Yeah, we have, um, plants all around the apartment as well. Um, and I do have a crystal always, uh, near my, I have a couple crystals near my, um, stream setup all the time. Let me... Do I have it around here? Where, where is she at? Where's my favorite crystal at? I have an anxiety crystal. I might have I might have moved it to the bedside. I had a... Uh, not gonna lie. Uh, I had like a... Like a... I don't want to say like an anxiety attack. But I kind of did last night. Um, I kind of had like an... I like an episode last night. Um, I go through them sometimes uh especially when i feel extra down on myself but it it is i always make sure i have like i always make sure i have my crystals and everything that something that like tangible and uh can remove this sensory overload that i go through during those type of experiences and i think it's uh everyone has to have something to believe in um, for some people they use faith, for some people they use, uh, um, they use friends. Uh, my, my, my comfort has always been in rocks and crystals. Um, and, uh, I have a, I have a, uh, a geode that I cut and I, um, sanded down that's always on my, uh, that's always on my stream setup as well. We have to find we have to find the uh, the boat. Oh, the boat's over here. Okay. Well, let's go take our jet ski right on over. Ooh. I need to get I need to get the helicopter. That is our next. That is our first goal. Is we're gonna get the helicopter. We want to go to Ted Selly. You do uh, you do you absolutely. Faith never is needs to be justified. Uh, if it gets you through hard times, it's amazing. Yeah. See, that's that's the thing is I. Uh, I'm not a spiritual person in that regard at all. Any facet of the word. Um, uh, I, I believe, I, I try to believe in myself and in others, um, like tangible physical people. And I think that's why, I don't know. My, uh, my fiance and myself are, uh, we love crystals. Uh, so, and I've always loved crystals since I was a, a wee little, wee, wee little lad. I, uh, I've always enjoyed crystals, so I just, uh, naturally realized, well, I mean, I always, I always feel much more in touch with nature. Maybe there's, uh, some validity to it. Is this my dad? Is my dad in the game? Yo, this looks like my dad. Yo! Okay, so I've been here. I did not put. I I just I just went in here and I bought something. I I didn't even investigate because I wanted to do this on stream. So, for context, uh, my camp dad, his first name is Jim. All right, he looks a lot like my dad. And, um, so his name being Jimmy, 
uh, is quite on the nose. Okay. All right. Um, Aaron, you're an Wiccan yourself, so I totally understand alternatives. Absolutely. Uh, I, 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 I kind of find myself siding more with the Becca side of things, being more of a, like, atheist. You, uh, you come in, I come to the store. Ooh, didn't mean to send that. Oh my God. <laughs> oh, please. It is full circle. It's literally my dad. This is my dad. So... I'm going to ask him if he's proud of me, and uh, I hope the answer is yes. LOL. I want a boombox. It's a family heirloom. 60! Oh my god, 6,000! Do we set causing chaos? Do we set always causes chaos? Are we not? I'm not surprised. I've never been surprised a day in my life. Let's get, let's get, a, let's get some gold paint. I want that gold, I want that gold, uh, I want that gold jet ski, yo. Well, I'm gonna have to save up for the, um, what is this? The gold pocket watch. That's a gold pocket watch. Time flies with these. That'd be 20k. Oh my god, I actually know what this is. And all I see is Becca's message, I'm an atheist. And you're like, excuse me, what? No, it, it is, uh, we are chatting about, um, we are discussing, um, the importance of, uh, spirituality, spirituality, and all that jazz nonsense that we believe. I believe! Hold on. Oh! Golden Jet Ski! Let's go! We're gonna have to watch that one on here. <laughs> We're gonna have to watch the, uh... <laughs> the celebratory sounds on, uh... I do it uh, on YouTube a lot more than we do on Twitch. That's for certain. <laughs> God damn! All right, jet ski. Let us go work on our... We're going to work on our little area. Oh, yeah. I don't have that one yet. <laughs> What is that area? That area's built up? Who the heck did that? Not me. Hello? Look at this little island here. I could put something there. Like a little lighthouse. Wouldn't a lighthouse be cute? Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. They hype differently on YouTube. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. All right. All right. Okay. For sure. Absolutely. I need to get a different absolutely not still, but we're working on it. We're working on it, I swear. Y'all, I have work every single dang day of the week. I can't even, I barely have time for myself. When we get in the helicopter, I need money, Becca. I need money and I don't have any. I need to have like three million dink and I have like two million po two point three million dink. The yeah, absolute should be oh it, it really should be David. I, I want that sound bite. I'm I'm trying to make that sound bite happen. I'm making it happen. Don't you fret. It's happening. It's coming into fruition. Um We're gonna build this up. We gotta build this up. I'm thinking, I'm thinking what we do to build this up is, uh, I had the idea, and tell me if this works, is we build um, right here, let's do this. 
we build up along here and do... Well, thunderstorms are happening. Um, so that means a thunder egg potentially could spawn. So that's fun. But I want... What I want to do is I want to dig and create a, uh, I want to make a gazebo, but using, you have a massive chicken run? Oh yeah, no, y'all are going to, y'all are going to get your own, get way better of a pen back here. I'm going to put the, the chicken farms and everything. I'm going to put them all over here. Either back here or I'm going to put them in a new area. Um, you're going to get your own, uh, everyone in chat is going to get their own animal, um, to celebrate. We're going to get our, everyone's going to get their own animal today. So, uh, yeah, to celebrate the commemoration of this where everyone's getting an animal. We're gonna, we're gonna, and we're gonna make a new pen area for a new campsite area. So my idea is if I make this out of wood, um, what we can do, I don't know what you gonna, you, uh, you look like a moo if that helps. Oh my God. <laughs> don't say that. Don't say you look like an emu. Don't do that. <laughs> I bet you look spiffy, so don't even question. You're gonna get yourself. You go get yourself a beautiful animal, okay? You are a beautiful animal. Every single one of us are beautiful. Y'all are beautiful people here. Okay, I think I'm gonna do this, and then we're going to put um, a bridge. So, the plan is, if we make them to the side here, this might look like a building if we put a bridge underneath it. You know, like a gazebo? Or a per... I don't know how to print it. I don't, I don't know how to say words here. We don't know how to speak words here. Let's do this. Let's do that. Let's do that. And then look at that golden jet ski. That's beautiful. That's beautiful. Excuse me, sir. Hello. This area at night. Gorgeous. Look at this little area here. Look how gorgeous that is. Who are we kidding? What up, Erwin? Erwin. Uh, I saw what a capybara looked like on someone else's stream. Oh, the, uh... Oh, the, um... Yeah, 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 the, like the wombat. Yeah, 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 yeah. These guys right over here. These, these baddies right here. These guys. It's Gabriel. It's my friend Gabriel. And just for that, you go get yourself one of those. You gonna be you gonna be one of yourselves. That's what you gonna be. Fletch, did I what are you pooping? You pooping in there? Quit pooping. <laughs> Fletch is pooping. Not me having all the mail in the entire world and I'm not checking in a single one of them. Oop. Don't put me on blast now. All right, listen, hey, the reason I have so much mail, okay? All of this is all of this is planned mail, okay? All of that is mail that we can use uh they're like furniture that we can use on the island, but I don't want to access them in a way that would, uh, is this Melvin? 
Okay, I need to make sure Melvin, um... I got two wooden couches on me. Yeah, I'll, I'll sell you my two wooden couches. That's fine. You're a furniture guy, so that's fine. What's up, dude? Trying buckets. Okay, well... Melvin, you better come back. Melvin better come back. Fertilizing, that's what us old people call it. Eh. <laughs> Stop. Old people, hello? I, I feel like I feel like I'm old a lot of times when I play when I when I stream. Um I I feel old sometimes. Even me. Even this young boy me myself. I uh so many of my friends um at my work and in my area are they they're all like, ah oh, man, I'm so old and I went Wait, y'all, what? And they're like, hi, I'm 21. And I'm like, what? Shut up. Shut up. Don't make me feel old. I'm still a young boy. Don't make me feel old. I know. Like, Becca, like, don't even though, because you're not. You're only a couple years older than me, so don't even say that. You're not a senior citizen. Not even in the slightest. Literally, I know I know exactly how old you are in your Hello? Oh I got myself a thunder egg! Let's go! <laughs> it just struck next to me! Hello? They were like, do you want to be hit by lightning? And I'm like, no. And they're like, here's a thunder egg. Yeah. <laughs> I thought that was in real life. I was like, oop. I was like, the lightning be hitting me already over here. Hello? I'm like, please don't hit me, sirs. Had to make the same day appointment with the um, acupuncturist today. Uh, oh my gosh. No, you're not old. Stop it. Don't even. Don't even. Stop. Would you, would you, would you stop that nonsense? You are not old. Don't even. I'm going to fight you. How the heck am I? Okay. I need to do this. I've discovered that I have royally messed this up. We're going in with the chainsaw, everybody. Oh. We need to put, um, wheat seeds in between. Wee. There we go. Huh? Huh? Yeah! Wheat! Alright, let's... Let's build... Let's start doing our campsite here. We're gonna do that tomorrow when the day is clean and fresh and nothing is gross. And it's not raining. I don't know about y'all, but when it's raining, I can barely get anything done. When it starts raining, I'm like, you know what? I'm going to stay inside. I'm going to play. I'm going to hang out. I'm going to just have a good time. I'm not going to go outside. Outside is scary. Who has the time? Not me. Not me. Not me at all. I don't have the time. I don't know how to read a clock. Don't know how that works. All right, let us put some watermelons down. I want watermelon. I want watermelons. Melons. Eh. <laughs> 
Look at me moving like an old ass man. Hello? Hello, ma'am? <laughs> Hang glider, go! So, tomorrow in game, the plan is I'm going to go get some more. Um, I'm going to build a new bridge. Uh, I'm going to get some more stuff for... We're going to get some more things. The things being uh, grass fur seeds. I'm going to get some fur seeds over in a different biome and collect some more flowers. We need better flowers. We don't have the good flowers that we need. Bug tipster. Who has the time to be a bug tipster? Not me. Hello? But I do want this. Yeah. Excuse me. I have a I have a lava lamp to place. Excuse me. Oh wait, hold on. Hold on. Oh my god, red lava lamps are fucking dope, dude. They're they're so cool. Do they do they eliminate red light out here too? Hold on. They do. Yo, they make red light out here. This is a this is a game changer. We're putting that out there. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. We'll put that here for now. So cute. So excited about it. Oh my god. Oh my god. You are not growing a tree right here. No, get out of here. The hell? Who has the time? Not me. A warm Nordic lamp. Ew. I do want to move this, though, too, as well, eventually. I want to move this area to make it, um... I'm thinking of putting Melvin's, um, shop as well over here. Just, like, to accompany this space. Just to take up space. Space. Hmm. Hmm. Do we place? Hmm. I'm thinking the idea. The uh, the idea is we get those bridges built now, and then moving forward, we place. Yeah, let's do that. So. What we're doing essentially is with these, um, we're creating the facade of a, um, what are they called? Like gazebos. So we need a, uh, a bridge that would make, that would, that would make do for like a, a roof. I could do just the brick bridge. I have some somewhere. Just, I have uh, an abundance of them somewhere. Probably in one of these chests. Yes, we do we have three. So we're gonna take those. And then we're gonna take these. Maybe we place some tiki torches around. I'm thinking that would be the play. Hmm. Yeah, that's a good idea. Take those with me. So we can cook those. And then we have some grass fur seeds. I'm gonna go get some more though. We need more. We need more. Where's my jackhammer at? 
Is my jackhammer placed in a chest charging somewhere? Oh, it's right here. My compactor's here. My jackhammer's here. My additional compactor. So I actually got this one. Um, oh, I just charged that one. Why, why is this one not working? What? That's dumb. Oh, it has to be in your bar. Oh, your bar first. I'm such a dingus. I already had it charged. Well, you snooze, you lose, apparently. Um, I got one of those in the uh, the Dropbox, this compactor. I can't believe that. Such an interesting uh, a drop in, a, in the, uh, the Dropbox. Is, these things are super expensive. A dinkus? I'm a dinkus. Yeah, I'm a, I'm a dinkus. Yeah. That's... That's completely and utterly accurate. Yo, can I like put that? So now, got a cute like little building looking thing here. It's a building. Huh? Huh? It's a simple little building. That's a building. If we put, um, like, landscaping around it, we can make ourselves a, um, we really could, we really could make ourselves something pretty special here. Let's place some flower beds here. Maybe we'd put flower beds on this side to make it work. And then... I want the illusion that this is a, um, like a building. I wanted to do maybe a backdrop here, like close it in. That might help that, uh, that sensation, that feeling. I was also thinking if I do, um, arches to the side, it might look like a, um, like an archway, like a nice looking archway. Hmm. So let us break this grass here. Let's break this grass. And then let us... Let's just do this to help break the grass up. Because this is going to be... Uh, the fur grass is what we're going to grow here instead. But we have to... Got to do this first. There we go. Efficiency. It's not my... Is not my first uh, first name at all. There we go. This dark green is going to really pop in this area. Yeah, the dark green's really gonna pop in this area. See how see how see how easy the grass growing is going to really make this area look just that much better. I might move these buildings out of the back area here and put more of the same. Um, I might keep them there. I might take them out. I don't quite know yet, but 
the idea could be if we put two statues right here or we put um we could put that or we could do the uh, street lamps street lamps might be nice too we are going to first and foremost excuse me sir i'm just getting out of your way excuse me i don't need to pass you by buddy excuse me you're just gonna pass you by thank you hang glider time getting out of dodge taking my hang glider and saying goodbye sirs i'm out of here um you know the funny thing is though right over here we have um This area's got a, a dig spot right there, and I don't want to dig that up. I'm just going to leave it. <laughs> Jackhammer time. Uh, the ore shore is looking nice. Starting to uh, look really good. I'm gonna start moving some more of those down when I get more items. I'm gonna do this nice and slow because if I do this all in one fell swoop, I know I'm I'm going to tire my mental self out and I won't want, I'll lose inspiration. Hmm. Because I could just sit and do this for an entire day's worth of uh, of playing and just crank out, like, a bunch of builds. And that wouldn't be as fun. It wouldn't be as fun. Let us go. Here. We're going to take a chainsaw. I could bring a scythe. But the chainsaw is automatic. Which is why I like the chainsaw. It just stays just stays going. You can get grass pretty easily this way. This is my grassy ways. And then I'm also going to take some of these um, trees here. I'm going to take some pine cones. We're going to plant some trees in the... Um... It's almost like we're implanting a brand new biome into that area. And I'm really a big fan of that. That idea. If we bring the uh, pine cones in, it would look really... Um... It would just fit a lot better than what we have currently right now. What is... What are these trees? I forgot what these trees are. What are you? Oh, these are... These are baby palm trees. Uh, okay. Got it. Got it. Hmm. We're going to cut down some more grass with my chainsaw. I need a weed whacker. That'd be fun. It's your dad cutting down weeds. My, uh, the, um, the landscaping in my apartment complex every Tuesday, constantly. This is, this is how it sounds like outside, just just weed whacking, just tools all the time, cutting the lawn. I'm like, y'all, can we stop? Like, landscaping, leave it alone. Everything looks great. Stop it. Not every single Tuesday do we need to do all that nonsense. We don't need all that nonsense. Okay. Um... I can get myself some bush limes, I think, for food. Uh, I also have somewhere nearby. I think it's down here. Over here I have like 
like a campground over here somewhere. I think it's down there, yeah. It is down there. I was like, maybe I should have grabbed a, um... Maybe I should have grabbed food. <laughs> or energy. Things for energy. I did not think I would, um... I didn't think to f to cook up my food. That's my bad. <laughs> Oopsie doopsie. All right, Gator, leave me alone. I have fruit to get. No, I'm gonna leave that. We're gonna leave you alone. Ooh, we gonna grow it up. We gonna grow it up. Please. Oh. Leave me alone. Y'all are going back to bed. He said, oh, I'm trying to go back to bed. This boy being aggro as hell. We're also looking for they're they're like a uh, they look like lavender, but they're called like common heath flowers. They only grow in this biome, and they're quite difficult to find. I've only found two so far. I did find some bush limes, so that will be good. I can eat those. For the temporary sake. Mm. Amazing. Great work by me just hang gliding into the water. Classic. Um... What is this? Well, that's a brand new bug that I don't have, and I don't have a net on me. LOL. <laughs> Whoops. That is my bad. Whoopsies. Not me having absolutely nothing. Squat. There is nothing in this biome. In my in my uh, pine biome, there's no flowers in my pine biomes. That sucks. That makes me sad. Good thing I'm going to come through here and cut everything down. Yeah, that is... It's like not really like a, a thing you can... It's not like a real biome, but you could just... Like the idea that you can change the landscape of the ground to... The grass to change color and you can have different colored grass and you can have different... You can have different trees that grow in different biomes and areas that you couldn't normally have. It really changes the um, complexion of what you want to do in a in a build where animal crossing if i wanted to place palm trees down my palm trees had to go on they had to be grown on sand like, like well that's what they grow on but it's like here i can place it i can place it on any material this bad boy i can just plop that bad boy down and we say ready to go we're all set which I uh, love and respect. I got two bright wire from that. Hello? Who said that was okay? I'll take the old toy. I don't need that. But I do need this. 
I need, need fur grass seeds. We need all of this. All of it. All the grass. Give me all the grass. Getting grass or getting ass? Hell yeah. he who is this oh that's a uh, oh that's a big boy oh a big boy maybe both at the same time <laughs> yeah. okay you better believe it whatever you want you know I'm all about it I'm always down to share No, don't stab. Dig that bad boy up. Put him on in. Right on in. Hell yeah. Hello? Sir? Hello, sir? I need more bush limes. Bush limes. Let's dig. Dig that up. Dig that up. And then we're gonna dig you up. Dig this. Place that there. And then we'll place a bridge. Why? Oh, it's not the same level? What? Oh, weird. Wasn't even the same level. My bad. Get myself some fur grass. Don't even look. Don't even be f coordinated. Just start swinging and, and start right clicking. That is the way I do things. Do I have rhyme or reason? No. Is it sloppy? Yeah. Give me your sloppy cuts. Sloppy dappy. Woo! Hello? Oh! All the sloppy cuts.
Boom. Boom. Alright. And I don't even have to spawn these in. I'm not even gonna be spawning these in. I could. Ooh, I could. I could be using the cheat menu. I really could. But I ain't a, I ain't doing it. I ain't doing it. I'm a proud BB. I could go to a spicy island now. I could try to go to a spicy island and get more money. Just so I could have a helicopter. It's better when it's sloppy sometimes. Uh, oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Is it? I mean... I mean, it, I, I would, I would, I would agree. I would, I would 100% agree. I also think it's better when it's sloppy. <laughs> We're talking about the efficiency of an area. What, what are y'all the rest in chat thinking about? That's just what me and Aaron are talking about. I don't know what you're talking about. Come on, y'all. Get your heads out of the gutters. And put my dumb chaotic ass in there. Hell yeah. Yeah, pervs. I agree. Bunch of pervs. Not gonna lie. Let us plant some grass and some tr and some shrubbery, some shrubbery. Oh my god! Ow! Ow! Jerk! I didn't even do anything to you. I'm just living my life. Fur grass. Give me some of that ass and grass. My ass is grass. Putting all the grass. Put that grass in. Oh, hell yeah. Leave me alone, Mr. Crocodile! I don't want what you're selling! Please! No ready refresh. I don't want to buy your bottled water service. Please stop bringing it to my apartment. Stop trying to sell me bottles of water. I already have water. Don't yell at me about my tap water. Ow! Who gave you the right? Who gave you the right, sir? I'm gonna call your manager. I'm about to be a Karen. Anyone else in the chat a Karen? Wait. Hold on. I should call him. I should call him. <laughs> okay. We should call him. Hmm. 
we're gonna leave that leave the nice um print on the uh on the area Ooh, I like the green, man. This look this looks like a uh, looks like a mini golf course. This green, though, it kind of looks like uh, I'm uh, hanging out, about to vibe out with some uh, mini golf. I can I can mess with it though. I can vibe. We're gonna put that back. <laughs> um, the trees. Oh, these these guys will have to be put away. Hold on. Two seconds. I need to clear some space. Some bright wire will put you away. Put you away for good. What do we want to do? We're going to put this right here. That, that, that that this if you can get with this you can get with that if you can get with this you can get with that if you can get with this then you get with that and get with this because this is where it's at hey let's go place that down hello i'm here ready to go um flower bed flower bed and then it's um two here and one here and then one here right yeah <laughs> look at you look at you having a good old time let's place let's place some trees right here And then we'll put one there. And then we can put one here. And then before y'all go, you just put down grass. You can put them underneath. <laughs> That is off center. That's fine. I'm going to center it though. Before y'all come at me and tell me I did things wrong, I ain't about it. Let's put a tree here. Boom. And then how many spaces is that? Two. Right there. Perfectly symmetrical place. Beautiful. And then in front, I think I want to do a detailed uh, a detailed entryway here. Um, and then that back wall, I think I want to make this be carved back, potentially. It's, it's coming together. It's coming together. We're definitely getting to the place where we want to go. We may, may not be exactly there, but we're getting there. I want more flowers, I think. That's the issue. I want better flowers. And I don't have any to do that with. I definitely am going to use... I kind of want to grow... I kind of want to grow coconut trees. Um, my idea is that it's like a tropical oasis kind of growing area. Like a... Like... So I'm in, I'm picturing what I have here in Florida, basically. That's 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 my envisioned area. This just kind of is like a Floridian style, um, like a gazebo area. Is that I can grow, I can grow things here. Okay, 
It's telling me I'm tired. That's fine. I'm actually going to sleep here. There we go. Sleep till tomorrow. I like not having to go all the way back home. It is very helpful. Foraging goes up. Melvin is visiting. Maybe we can get Melvin to move in. Maybe today will be the day. Melvin says, You know what? I want to move in. I got to move in, Sonny Jim. And I'll be like, yeah. Give me some cement. I'm actually going to put it all along the back wall too, I think. Your dad and brother live in Jacksonville. Um, and you fell in love with Florida when you were uh, there over Christmas last year. Ooh! Hey, listen now. Listen, hey, we're... Uh, we are always looking to have more uh, Floridians. Always looking to have more Floridian friends. Just saying. Join us! <laughs> Join us! <laughs> There's already grass growing. Beautiful. Um, we're going to put some... I know it doesn't look balanced right now because it's not. Um, the uh, temptation is so real. You're so done with Nebraska. I, hey, listen, we, we are. You would be welcome here. That's for sure. At least from us, at least from the, uh... we'd love to have you. As if I'm like a representative of Florida, LOL. Um, I'm growing a coconut tree there, though. That's a pretty, pretty tempting little area, a little cutesy area. You like my, uh, you like my construction sign? I think my construction sign is kind of cute. I think it's a fun little, little, little sign that we got going here. I do want to put, um, fence, like, concrete fence along this way, I think. Maybe we'll get it, um... And then we'll build out from here, I think. That's adorbs. Oh, I, I just thought it was a cute little, I thought it was a cute little construction sign. I don't know. I thought, I thought it, it works and it works, you know. I like the idea of having a building that we make out of nothing, but in it, and it resembles a building in some facet. Never mind. Is that a purple couch? That's a purple couch! Purple couch! A Billy Button Pot. Who the hell? Who's Billy and whose buttons are we pushing? Who is the? Who are these boys? Leave them alone! Don't attack people. Okay, well, you better leave me alone. Hello? Don't, 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 don't perceive me. I'm, I'm just, I'm just a, a rainbow t-shirt. I'll do that. Triangle glasses? Nah. Hearty stew for short on meat. I've got meat. Hey, Theo, 
You looking for some meat? I got some meat for you, baby. Give me some stew, baby. I completed your request. I got you some meat, baby. Getting that meat. Warming my tum. Kind of. It gives me. Ooh. It gives me 45 health. Three minutes of buffs for my attack and defense. I do like. I do like that. That's a good time. Can you just leave me? Can you just leave me alone? Can he just leave me alone? I didn't ask. I did not ask for this. Just leave me alone. Melvin. 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 Hmm. Do I have any clothes? I have purple pants. We're going to go give these to uh, John Blaine Tim. Uh, <laughs> it says meat, uh, meat to stew up your guts. Oh my God. You're such a bad influence. Oh my God. <laughs> You're a great influence. What are you talking about? An amazing influence. Yo, yo, baby, I'm wearing a Krispy Kreme shirt. You already know. You already know I'm I'm invested. I'm invested in the cream. Oh, a rainbow T-shirt. Hello. Cute. What does this look like? Yes. Love it. Get away from me. Excuse me. I'm passing you by. Passing you by. What up, Melvin? Can you? Let's chat. Yeah, 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 yeah. You got a job for me? Can you find me a hearty stew? This is for you, Melvin. Here's a hearty stew. A wooden single bed. Are you telling me I'm single? Yo! Furniture shop, let's go! Let's go. Hell yeah. Got myself a furniture shop. Now I can build the furniture shop. Let's go. You better believe I'm going to be making them furniture shops, though. You already know. Oh, cement path. Nice. Nice. Hmm. What are we placing down yet? So now we can put now we can make Melvin move in. Sweet. So then we can have more furniture to buy. I'm all about it. I'm all about it. If we give the furniture shop though, that means I'm gonna have to move all of this stuff probably out. Hmm. Because I don't want to put it directly next to it. Because I, I want the spacing to look a little bit better on the map. Man, but a purple couch is going to look sweet. Does that look? That looks dope. <laughs> that looks so cool. I actually like the purple couch a lot. We're going to use this in a build at some point. We're going to put you away, though. Excuse me, sorry. I'm going to put you away, Mr. Friend. We're going to put my purple couch away. Hmm. 
What else can we get to make this area look great? We need hedges. We need to build some hedges. We have fern, bush. I have lots of, lots of that. Um, tin sheet. Uh, iron fences. Hmm, I want cement fences. Actually, I do want this. This is what I want. I want this. Cement and iron bars. Here. Let's get some cement. Get some iron bars cooking. Cement. And then iron bars. We are going to place this here. Am I going to make desert roses? I don't know how to make desert roses. How do you make desert roses? How do you do that? I would love to. I just don't know how to make them. I know I've noticed people have them. I just don't know how to actually physically make them. Um, I have desert like um i have like the desert rose pots but i don't have the actual like desert roses oh really that's such an elaborate plan oh my gosh i think you're right that's a great okay well i will do that then do i have the planters Um, I put my planters away, didn't I? I think I did. Come with logs and nails. Um, let's put my tin sheet. Just we're gonna put my tin sheet somewhere. Tin sheets going there. We're gonna get some gum with logs. Uh, my brick bridge is going to go live here as well as these stalls for now because my inventory is a mess. This is like last crosser standing right now or whatever. Um, the other one, <laughs> we, the last race. <laughs> I have too much stuff in my inventory at all times. Um, I'm going to make some cement fence. As well as some hedges. Okay, that works. Iron cement fence. Cement fences. See how that looks in contrast. Um, cement steps. That would be nice. Alright, let's... I bury a bone, grow some stuff. I'm going to try that. Let's see. I have planters here. Let's try it. Eh. Like that. Let's try that. Let's see. We'll come back and see if there's anything growing in there. If there's something growing in there, sweet! I would love to put uh, desert roses everywhere. I just don't usually have the uh, materiales for it. 
Or I have the materials, but I don't have the uh, conviction. Look at how this looks. See, the this is what I mean by the importance of using different uh, materials and ground materials. Look at this. Uh, look at the mud here. Look how great mud looks as a um, an accent piece in this area. Just looks so nice. We are going to buy you though. You're going to get your animal here. If I can buy a vombat, I can. This is. Do you want Marquan or do you want Aaron? It would be good. It's good advertisement for you. <laughs> How about that? That are um, we can do, we can do that. Whatever you prefer. We'll do that. It's up to you, my friend. It's up to you. But you are going to be forever immortalized in our little pen. You're going to have a cute little pen. Uh, I need to also put a flower pot or plant a flower and it's immediate. Oh, I need to put a flower pot or plant a flower and it's immediate. Okay. Got it. Interesting. All right. I have flower pots. I can do that. Can do. We're going to do this. Grow. Grow. I think I'm going to grow it now. You're joining our land. There you go. My friend! You are here. Forever immortalized. I'm going to get you. I love what research is telling you. Well, I love that. Research is always the best. We love when we have good research. I don't ever research when it comes to this game. I just kind of discover myself and figure it out as it comes. As it comes in. For the most part, it serves me well. Let us put our hedges here. Hedges, hedges, hedges. Let's do that. Let's do that. And then... Let's do that. And then we'll do back pieces here. Yeah, that looks great. Starting to come together, y'all. As much as I like tiki torches, the tiki torches look kind of jank in here. So we're going to put the tiki torches away, the t-shirt and the hedge, put all that away. Um, do 
Do I have extra fur seeds? Fur grass seeds? Do I? I actually don't know if I do. I do have one flower pot. Okay, so I need to place a flower pot and a flower. What kind of flower do we need? Can I use a belly button? Or whatever these are things called? These uh, billy buttons? I guess I call it a belly button, excuse me. <laughs> a belly button? Who is this? And who are we talking to? Let's do um, cement fences here. Let's do that. You lad, I guess you just have to place on the you just have to place it on the bones, no need to bury it. Oh. Got it. Can do. You just have to place the thing and don't have to bury it on wood. Okay, so that's interesting. So I can grow as many desert roses as I want just with it. Oh, with that? Okay, very, very nice, very interesting. Let me try it. Let's try it. Right. Bones, bones. Then we're going to place you here. like moves it though what does that do it, like just moves it how does that work Is that really how it works? Is that it? Is that all I have to do? Here, hold on. Or do I set this down on top of it? I'm going to set these up like this and then I'm going to leave it and then I'm going to come back to it and try that again. Fences all up the wazoo.
I'll give it like one in-game day. How about that? Here. Let's go desert rose dang gun. Oh. Oh, I know what it is. Okay. All right. I I know how to fix it. Okay. Got it. I actually know how to fix that. I know why it didn't work. Because I you it needs to be bones that are on the ground. Like not like not like bones that I place on the ground. It's bones that are already built into the ground. The bones that I was trying to do this with were not that. got it so so if this works right what we need to do is let me toss you let me toss you i don't need any of that let's try it now let's see what happens so we're going to go up to these bones here and we're going to place that there that worked there we go see perfect Very cool, actually. It has a purpose for bones, actually. It makes the bones actually useful. Full bones? No, you're good. Cool. Makes sense. I like it. I like it. <laughs> Not me saying I like it. Oh. This is great, actually. This is totally useful. I bet you this is, I bet you this wasn't intentional. There's no way this is intentional. I bet you there was, I bet you they wanted him to, to have desert roses just grow in the desert, like on the ground, like maybe on cactus or something. And, uh, and they found that this is the only way to get desert roses is by dropping flower beds on bones i bet you that's the way it is you did half good you did great i didn't even think you i didn't even think that this was i just thought they had a chance to spawn in the desert i bet you there's a reason there's a way to grow heaths then that way too the common heaths i bet you there's a way to grow those like make them up, appear and grow just the same way i bet you there's a code there's a way in the code to do that not me totally gonna try that out next time not me just gonna spawn a bunch of stuff in and try and make that happen. With all the grass. Look at this area! It's so nice! Who is she? Who is she? Maybe I get a like a fountain right there in the center. Starting to come together. Starting to look beautiful. Let's get some desert roses. Ooh, actually, let's place you along here. Add some pink in there. Um, there's some grass that's not fully taken care of, unfortunately. Maybe we can put these like here, maybe? The problem with desert roses is they have a like a black look. 
they're like the dark wood look into them. So I placing them. They feel more like a hmm. They look nice. It's just it's a different vibe. I'm gonna place them along here. It adds color. I like that. I think the color looks really pretty there. Maybe we can put... Oh! Wait. I really like that. This kind of looks cool when you do this with the fences. Like the variation, the, the, the variety of the heights. I kind of like this a lot. I'm going to do that and make it look just different. That looks so nice. Man, this area is really coming together. This is like my new favorite area. It really is. Maybe we do this and then... Just place you there. Very good. Just fixing things. There we go. Nope. Okay. All right. Let's go get some more desert roses with our bones that we've now acquired that we don't need any use for. Really, I don't know what the use is for the bones, actually. Um, this area is beautiful. But what you could do for the, um, what I could really do for the, I uh, like, you could do for campsites in all of these different areas and the different biomes. When you have, when you have, uh, Things like the Desert Rose, you have things like the Common Heath looks like Lavender. You really can make your campground really look and pop really nice if you want to make a, a, a campground. So like for here, the Desert Rose looks really great. Honestly, obviously in the desert, it looks really, it fits better out here. Like the color, the contrast, it like fits the vibe out here, right? But if you're going to do something like more um, tropical. Even the color palette adding in this pink and this dark brown really kind of takes away from that area. And I think uh, what we could do, instead of use all these desert rows for that, we try and get some of these. We get some seeds and uh, some wattle seeds. I get some of these. Um, I don't see any seeds there. Let's try that. Cool. So let's, maybe we can spawn in. Maybe we can get something to spawn in, I should say. We should get Flowers, flowers, flowers. Do we have, we have two seeds. Maybe we get a couple more. 
me discovering the mangrove uh, trees can grow into any biome. Love that. How do we get the heaths, man? How do we get the heaths? If I have to just find them, that's gonna be a pain in the ass. Um, let us get rid of poop. Good. Just me just cutting. Don't mind me. I know you're trying to sleep there, bush devil. Here, I'm just sitting here cutting around you, buddy. Don't worry about it. We're just hanging out, cutting right back next to you. Don't mind me. There we go. Sorry, excuse me. Oh, oh, sorry, sir. Thought you were asleep. My bad. Excuse me, sir. We were just asleep here. Excuse me. Excuse me, sir. Just here asleep. Just you're asleep. Sorry, sir. Sorry, sir. Just cutting down this area here. Excuse me. <laughs> Chainsaws kind of, kind of are awesome. <laughs> in every, in every facet of the word, awesome in this game. Not only do they constantly have um, just this constant barrage of like multiple attacks at once, it's just you can clear out an area with these pretty well. Get a bunch of seeds. And because you just have to charge it, you don't have to make another one. Possibilities really are many. You could just sit and farm this all day long. Grass grows really fast too in this game, which I really like. Maybe we go spawn some, get some more desert rose over here. Um, I don't know what I get rid of. Everything seems kind of useful. This bat. Hell yeah. Excuse me. Useless stuff. Not worth dropping any of my other stuff for. I gotta go. Let's go that way. Let's go a little bit more further and see if we can find any more. See if we can find any of the heaths. Wrong way. <laughs> oh. Maybe I should go to where I see the trees. L O L. I have 31 desert roses. That's kind of good. Kind of helpful. Let's get some more grass. I 
Sorry if, just gr if grass getting is uh, not as relaxing and comforting because it is louder um, and monotonous and tedious. But this is what I do off stream. This is this is this is what I do. I just do all of the same things that I do for building. And we're just gonna be doing my process for building. Why? What I do what I do when I build off stream. I need to find I need to find some heaths though. I really do. I need to find these plants. They look like lavender, and I really like them. I think they're really uh, pretty flowers. I need like handfuls and handfuls of them. They might be good for um I don't know, they might be a good f addition to the area we're building, but it also just might be This might be an impossible task because I don't see any. No. No, no, it's it's all good. It's it's all good. Oh. How do you like it for a change when you're on fire? How about that? Kill them. Booyah. Um, I don't have any food still. Whoops. Mobby. This feels like Legend of Zelda over here where it's just the the death sound. I really don't want to die because I have 1.4 million dink on me and I would lose a lot of money if I died. So let's not die and say we did. Chainsaw. Let's get rid of um, my croco meat. Cool, I got some bottle bushes. Those are good. Those are useful. Let's do that. Oh yeah. Okay. This area might actually be the best place f to find any of these heaths right over here. Because they're like just hidden, secluded little landing strips where there's nothing that would disturb that area. There's no other biomes that could spawn in and make it so that they can't grow. Also possible. Oh man. I am exhausted. Wow.
I could get here. I'm just gonna get myself some apples here quick. I'm gonna heal myself up. There. I'm still exhausted, but um, I can heal myself up at least. I've got more seeds. I'm, I'm probably going to go back through all these biomes and see all the grass that I just left. Just uncut and just left up. It's going to be great. Let's go back to the Teletower. Booyah! All right. <clears throat> I'm going to plant some of these around the town. These right here, I want these flowers, the common heath. These things look really good. Yet. I want this flower in every area. God dang it. My inventory is full as can be, man. Full as can be. Do the tower ports teleport the same page each time? Yes, it does. Um, so the teleporters are here, 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 and here. So you can teleport. Um, yeah, you can, when you go click on a teleport tower, you can click on a tele, the teleporter tower that you want to go to. Um, so you, you choose where you go, basically. You can also set one down yourself. You can play, uh, you can buy one to place in your own, um, like I could, I could make a teleporter. No, it's not like the Animal Crossing pipes. No, um, the uh, teleport towers. You can actually build a telepad in you, like your own like fifth teleporter, and place it wherever you want. So if I want to put one in like my town, I could put a teleporter in my town and like be permanently there. No, it's not random. Which is pretty nice. It's like Skyrim fast travel. So then we're going to put bush, fern, fern. What's Skyrim? I don't know. A game. It's not Animal Crossing, that's for sure. <laughs> we only speak in Animal Crossing. My brain tells me if I put um, another flower bed in the back, it would look nice. 
but my brain's also telling me that the, my too much gene is going to take over. Here, I'm going to do this. Grab some grass. And then we're going to bury that. Making a coconut tree here. Because the way the coconut tree there looks great. I actually want to put another one here, I think. Um, so see the way the coconuts bend. And then we can grow, um, I'm thinking we can grow, we might be able to grow like sugarcane along the sides to make it look like bamboo. I would love to do that because we don't have bamboo yet. That's something I wish we had was bamboo. So do I place a bottle brush? I'm gonna try that. Let's try this and place some seeds underneath it. There we go. There we go, and then I, oh, I need to fix. And then I need to put the cement fence back. There we go. Um, let's try. Let us try the regular wattle seeds. Back here. Right here. Yeah, we're going to dig right here. That works. Get some grass seeds. Boom. Boom. And where's the head? Do I have more of those hedges? Gotta have more hedges somewhere. I have one hedge. I kind of want to place a couple of hedges right here. Right along here. I'm going to make some, I think. I need palm wood and I need an arch, a hedge arch as well. I want that. Boom. Now we need palm wood planks. Hmm. I'm going to set more of these here. I'm going to place some seeds here. Fill their pockets with bushes. <laughs> All right, we ain't, we ain't playing. We ain't playing some uh, <laughs> lost race here, okay? All right. <laughs> this is not... <laughs> it's not the same thing, okay? It's very similar, but it's not the same. I promise. All right. It's not quite. 
not quite the same. I need to figure out how to build the path to it. Yeah, no, I feel like I feel like everything's been going really well for this. This is this is pretty great. We've been doing pretty good so far today. Everything's looking good. Our builds are looking good. Everything's going well. Overall, we're having a great time hanging out here on YouTube. It's been great. And it will only get better as we stream more on here. So I'm going to build two arches. And then... I want to build a street lamp. I have an iron bar. Some glass. Iron bar, glass light bulb, and quartz. Um, it's looking good so far. I'm glad. Everything, I think, is looking great. I think everything's positive. Everything's good. Let's grab... I don't need I don't have enough to make another iron bar, but we're gonna put that there. If I get another iron bar, I would love to make another one of these. These garden lamps actually are pretty great because I can make a couple of these. Let me get myself a couple more light bulbs. There we go. And then... You like the garden lamps a lot? I do too. I think the garden lamps look great. The street posts, the street lamps are good. The garden lights are really good. Let's get a couple of those. You're using them in Animal Crossing too? Yeah, I use them in Animal Crossing a lot as well. I, I think they're among my favorite um, lamps. All right. So then let's go back over to where we need to go. And then we'll sort of finish not officially finish but sort of finish what we've been doing very underrated yeah i i i use them in like every build i'd ever do all my i i have i always place them there's never a place that there's not those placed they're just perfect in so many ways This is annoying. Oh, this is really annoying me. So let's put these at the edge of these. Like that. There we go. Sure. Everything I build is off center, okay? <laughs> I've discovered this about myself. Very, uh. Garden lights here. And then in the corners, we'll put the street lamps. I 
I can put these outside of it. Maybe I can put this on a... I like it so far. I'm not sold on it yet, but I like it so far. All right. We're going to need... We're going to place some stuff down. All right, we are going to end probably right here. So I'm going to put myself to sleep. Sleeping bag. Call it a day. Hello, Gabriel. Welcome on in, Gabe. Welcome on into the stream, Gabe. How's it going? Is that a wild Gabe I see? How's that going? Melvin's visiting. You're just joining us as we're ending. Thank you everyone for tuning out today's stream. Oh my gosh. This is this has been very, very, very uh successful day of uh just hanging out, relaxing. Um we we are actually uh so I want to I want to raid somebody on um I don't have command set up but I do want to raid somebody um and the person that I do know I can raid uh they Jesus um is live right now we have Blaine's live right now we can raid Blaine I don't know He's doing, he's doing stuff for Lost Falls right now. Does anyone else have anyone else that we could we could raid? I don't know how raiding works on YouTube besides just copy and pasting the links. I think that's the only other way you do it. But we're here. We're having a good time. Um, I don't know if Blaine's is only subscribers can chat. I think that might be the case. So with that, I don't think we can do that. So never mind. Mm. We'll just end it here then. Why not? We'll just end it here. I don't know. We'll, we'll do that next time we stream. Uh, thank you everyone today who's hung out today and chatted. Been the greatest people in the entire world. We appreciate you very, very much. Um, don't worry. We will be back again with uh some more dinkum and another date probably some other days coming up soon um i have a lot of work that i need to plan out so other than that we're gonna have some good coda time exactly coda time but y'all have a fantastic rest of your day and i will see you potentially on youtube potentially on uh twitch i don't know yet i will try to alternate between doing both because I just want to hang out. I've been wanting to work on YouTube videos myself. Yes, thank you everyone for joining my very my first voyage into YouTube. Honestly, it's been it's been a great day so far. So hopefully, 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 we're just here to vibe and have a good time. So I will see y'all at a different date. Check my socials, Discord, Twitter, all the jazz. But I will see you again. Peace, love, and camping, and I will see you later. Bye, friends. <laughs>